Hey everyone, Ajaxer here. I just wanted to show you guys what you'll be able to make at the end of this video. So let's hit play. And no fancy particle effects, but if you hit Q, we'll do a little updraft. And if you hit Q in the air, you'll do updraft again. You can also dash while you're updrafting. Okay. And um, that's pretty much it. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, hit subscribe, and support me. And hope you enjoy. All right, let's get into this. So I'm gonna start off by making an updraft region, kind of like we did with the dashing in the smoke. All right, so there's a couple functions that we'll need, but first let's define the variables. Um, so we'll have a public bool is updrafting, and then we'll just initialize this to false, and then we'll have some updrafting private variables. So float last um, time updrafted we'll just set this to zero private float and then we'll have let me see we'll have updraft height equals 4.0 f is just a value that I put and you guys could mess around it with it and then we'll have updraft delay seconds and then I just did 0 0.2 f and then we'll also do the attempts so we'll have um, like we do with dash attempts do we want to do that yeah we do um, dash so we'll say updraft attempts uh, and then we'll make this an integer int I'll just put that as zero and then we'll have a, uh, a another int and then we'll say max updraft attempts um, this isn't like necessary. I'm. Uh, by the way, I'll just make this ten. Uh, <laughs> so we have all those variables declared. I think that's all we need. And then we're just gonna need to lay out some functions. So we'll see. Void handle updraft is one. Void updraft is another. Uh, void on updraft start and then void on updraft end. Okay, so let's just start off by filling out these on updraft start and updra on updraft end, similar to how we do our smoke. It's just going to be updating a couple variables. Uh, so let's do that real quick. Um, so we'll set on updraft start, we'll say it is updrafting equals true. Last time updrafted equals time dot time, and then this is where you would hide your gun, which we're not going to do in this tutorial. But uh, if you guys want to, you can. And then here we set is up is updrafting to false, and then also you would show your gun. So that's it for the both of these functions, and then let's go into our updraft. And so we'll say we have a reference to our player controller right now. And we'll check if is grounded. Uh, if not, so don't forget to put that exclamation point before. And then we'll say player controller dot jump velocity dot y equals math f dot square root. And then we'll say updraft height divided by 2.5f times negative 2f times Oops, player stats dot grab. Oh, we need a reference to our player stats, so let's go create a player stats right here. Player stats at the top, and then make sure you it's a component already attached to our game object. So now we have a reference. Um, just make sure you have this get component in your start, and then we'll have a player stats. Hopefully you guys could see. Uh, just wanted to zoom in a little bit more. Uh, player stats dot gravity. Okay, we can finish that off. So this this right here. Okay, let's just finish this function real quick. I'm gonna come in here and copy and paste this. And then instead of dividing this updraft height by negative two point five f, I'm just going to um, just do this. 
So the reason why I did this 2.5F would would this value right here would be smaller than this. Um, so if you updraft with Jet, the first time you updraft is bigger than if you updrafted while you were in midair. And so what we're doing here is if we are not grounded, we're going up a mount smaller than this updraft height because we're dividing this number. And then if we are grounded, then we're doing you know the the bigger amount. Uh, that's it for this function. Okay, so this is the final piece of this. So we'll have a bool is trying to updraft, and then we'll do et key get key down, and we'll do key code dot q. I just did q because I think that's the default in Valorant. You can customize it however you'd like. And then if time dot time. So here we're going to check if the updraft has ended. So we're going to um, updraft, uh, let's see, delay seconds. And then if is updrafting, then we'll say on updraft end. Let's hit return. Okay, and then if is trying to up, that's it for that if block, and then in a separate if block will uh, actually call the updraft and stuff. So we'll see if is trying to updraft, and then we'll check if we have the attempts to um, max sorry, max updraft attempts. Then we'll say on updraft start, and then updraft. Okay, and then we also need to update these updraft attempts and max updraft attempts so we can, in on updraft start, we can say updraft attempts plus plus. Okay, now that we have that, um, make sure you call handle updraft inside the update function. And here's something as well, you uh, in, in our update function, uh, you can't throw a smoke and you can't updraft in the middle of your dash. So let's check if we are dashing. If we are, then we handle both of those abilities. Uh, this was a bug from the last video. Uh, small but impactful. Um, so now that we have those, I think we can just hop into Unity and Wait for it to load, and hopefully it doesn't poop itself. Okay, let's see. Nope, it definitely pooped itself. I have found the issue. Um, it's not if we are dashing, then we can do it. It's if we are not dashing. Uh, silly, silly mistake. Okay, let's go back. <laughs> and then see, we now have updraft. So you can also just float in the air and then if I do this 10 times, I can't do it anymore. And we'll just drop. So that's how you do updraft. It's really simple. Um, you can also uh, updraft and dash. So boom. something also you can do in uh, Valorant with Jet. And then let's see, what else can you do? Uh, also, just to point out, I guess you can, the second updraft is smaller you know mid-air updrafts are smaller or weaker than when you just launch off the floor and you guys can mess with these numbers um, but updraft is really simple so thank you for watching ajax are out